a questo punto credo di poter dare la parola alla collega Plumb per eh, proseguire diciamo, il saluto di apertura. Grazie. Thank you, thank you very much, uh, Emilia, thank you very much for uh, your uh, um, idea to organize this, uh, this conference, which uh, such a sensitive subject, such a sensitive topic uh, in the European uh, Union, and not only in the European Union. Uh, I would like to uh, thank to all of you for your uh, participation in uh, at this uh, event. And uh, I would like to excuse myself for the little delay uh, we, uh, with, uh, I have here in the European Parliament the Chinese uh, delegation uh, representing the All China Swimming Federation, which comprises not more than 625 uh, million uh, women. And we also discussed uh, on this important subject with Britta Thompson, who is the coordinator for gender policies uh, on behalf of SRT Group here in the European Parliament. Of course, um, uh, as uh, probably Nina said to you, uh, and uh, you know uh, already that uh, uh, this uh, subject appeared for the first time uh, as topic for discussion in, uh, in Romania. Uh, I noticed uh, that uh, two uh, or three huge uh, uh, NGOs from Romania, Alternative Sociale, UNICEF, the, represent the representation in Romania, and uh, uh, Suresh Foundation in Romania, uh, made uh, a study regarding the phenomena on uh, children, uh, regarding the children left uh, behind. And I've noticed that uh, a lot of, a large number, a huge number of children uh, remain alone at home uh, and their parents, one or both of the parents, uh, are uh, m uh, migrant uh, to the other member states because uh, we try to, 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 to see and to solve and to find solutions, concrete measures, first here in the European people and then according in the context of the globalization, we have to, to find solutions and to extend our views and our proposals, of course, uh, in the global context. But first of all, um, I'd like to say that we have to, 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 uh, to uh, obtain, to have, to realize, to elaborate concrete measures and proposals in order to tackle this important and sensitive, as I told you, phenomena here in the European Union, and I am very grateful uh, that you are coming here. And, uh, uh, I am waiting to, to, to see which, uh, which uh, ideas you have in order to, to support uh, and to tackle this uh, phenomena. Um, when I saw the situation in Romania, I came here in the European Parliament because I understand all the time that uh, here as representatives of the European citizens, we must uh, uh, come in front of them to solve some important problems that appear in our society because all of us, we are working for a fair society, for a fair European uh, Union. Uh, therefore, I initiated with my, uh, with my colleagues um, uh, an oral uh, question uh, which was followed by, the, by a debate here in the European Parliament and also a resolution uh, on this important uh, uh, topic. Well, uh, I would like to say only a few words uh, to, to underline what I, uh, what I mentioned in the, in the resolution, and I, I was very pleased that this was uh, uh, adopted uh, by uh, the plenary, and um, I underline that um, uh, in, this, in this resolution I asked the, the European Commission to conduct an evaluation of the proportions at the European level uh, of the phenomenon of the children who are left behind. Why? Because this situation is not happened only in Romania, but also in Poland, but also in uh, uh, Hungary, but also in Bulgaria, and 
other countries because the, ma the migration is something normal and the studies which are coming from the European Commission prove that, uh, that, that this the phenomenon of migration, migration is a positive one regarding the economy, but we have to study which are the social impacts at the level of the society. So the, the, the second, the, the second point, point that I underlined was that the, uh, I asked that the member states should improve the situation of those children left behind by their parents and to help them develop normally. Uh, then the member states to create mechanism of cooperation meant to prevent such devastating effects on families, especially on children. And uh, uh, we, we've noticed in the studies through, uh, showed us that, uh, um, uh, that the uh, negative impacts <coughs> is on, on the children who, who are alone at home uh, affect um, um, uh, the, the school uh, efficiency of uh, him and also his normally or her normally uh, the, uh, development uh, into the uh, society. Uh, they are the member, then the member states uh, should be, I, I am speaking so fast because I want to and we want to to, to see which are uh, your uh, your thoughts and uh, and idea then uh, I ask uh, to the member states to um, better inform immigrants and their families of their uh, rights with regard to the free movement and uh, of course to uh, I ask Member States and the European Commission to involve uh, and um, uh, the social partners and especially the, the NGOs to tackle this uh, important phenomenon because from our point of view the dialogue is uh, a key uh, in order to, to, to obtain better uh, results. Um, well, um, I would like to, uh, to tell you that uh, in response, the uh, Commissioner, uh, on behalf of the <coughs> European Commission, uh, said that uh, the European Commission, um, um, in 2010, launched um, the elaboration of a study. The name of the study, or the term, the subject, is the study on the social impact of emigration and rural-urban migration in Central and Eastern Europe. This study will uh, cover 25 member states and the phenomena regarding the children left behind will be especially studied and treated. And, uh, the, the study will be ready and will be presented by the Commission uh, in, uh, 2000, uh, in spring 2012. That means within one year. But this is to see the picture. But we need uh, to see which are the concrete, uh, the concrete measures and to make a lot of proposals. From my point of view, I think that it is better for the children, for the family, but for the entire society, that the children to be, not to remain at home alone, uh, 